Most people in life are looking at how do I make a life worth living in retirement with having. When I wake in the early morning hours, I discover once again that the molesters of the night, the children of the campus, the white bitches and bastards of the Catholic University here, have violated the law again. The problem with these children is that they fail to recognize where their rights begin and end. They feel that an old man's face is their playground. They allow the Muslims and the Indians to play around with someone's personal rights to their body, to their face, to their property. And what they do is they take women, like a woman named Anne in accounting, who doesn't know her rights begin and end, who stole things from a homeless man in the night, who really violated a man's privacy rights, and they just thought they'd keep playing on. The problem with this is, when does it happen to them? When does the rape, when does the abuse, when does the molestation happen to them? When do their friends turn on them for their violence? Last night a woman walked up behind me without my permission and consent and literally put her hands on my back trying to wish me a good night. you know how many fucking children had wished me a good night that I don't even know last night? At least six or seven with about 10 minute intervals apart. Do you have any idea how angry that made me? Because I don't know of any man of my age or generation or station that will entitle and entreat children to per perform that act. Think about it. How many strangers do you walk up to and give eye contact to and you tell them to have a good night? What lie did they tell themselves? that I'm in power over you, that I am in charge of you, that I'm just gonna piss all over you with my ideas about life. You see, none of these children of these parents of affluence and influence, whether they're American or whether from a foreign land, understand what's happening right now in political realms. They don't get the pulling out of Afghanistan because they're not paying attention to what it actually means in the real world. I'm not gonna tell them because they'll wake up someday and discover that. But the truth is that in life, when we talk about the truth, we talk about the truth. You've performed a molestation and a rape and the police have allowed it to occur. Isn't that interesting? That every person thinks they have a right to abate themselves from the responsibilities of their jobs. That's actually called malfeasance, but who gives a shit, right? Because it's not their face, it's not their child, it's not their life, it's not their body, it's not anything at all that does anything to do with their own humanity of life.